Here's our early week vlog posted on Wednesday. Bell! Come find me, Caitlin! Right here. Where'd she go? Here somewhere. I hear her. Listen to her voice. Just, uh, just looking at the snow falling. Why is it wet? Why is it wet up here? Yeah, I mean, I, I, I... Caitlin! Caitlin! Come find me! Come find me! Caitlin, go find Brianna! Huh? Where am I doing? Go find Brianna, go find Brianna. She went that, that way. Say. Go see if you can find her. Schools were closed because of the uh, weather. Daddy! Do you see that? Uh, more snow again, huh? It just never wants to stop. You guys you like the blizzard? You like the blizzard? He said, yeah. <laughs> I said, you like the blizzard? They said, yeah. Hope you're having fun! going on are we having like you guys are just going back in the snow I'm not going back in. I see a hand it's too cold to go back out there's a hand coming Look, out of the tunnel snow <sighs> I can't find her hmm. Hmm, she's hiding somewhere What are you up to? Huh? What are you up to? Sleepy. You're sleepy? <laughs> Look at this, huh? <clears throat> It's a lot of snow, face snow. No, but I don't know. Bye bye. Bye. So, Brianna, what do you suggest when you're going out in this cold like this, huh? I would suggest wearing like thick layers of clothes and make sure you're wearing the proper clothes. I don't have the proper clothes. Well, yeah, I do. I just can't find them. And I, I, I would wear a bunch of, I mean, like 10 pairs of socks, a lot of pants a lot of jackets, shirts, 
and just keep warm. And I would just be safe out there. And when you're playing in the snow, make sure if you're like about to go off a cliff or something that you either jump off of it or you roll off so that you don't get hurt. That's a good tip jump right there. Jump off a cliff. Doesn't sound no, 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 no. Like if you're say say no, 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 no. no. So say if you're sledding and there's a hill like we yeah. have out here, and then it goes down. There's a steep hill that goes into the woods, kind of yeah. like a cliff. Um, make sure if you're about to go down that, you you like not jump off the cliff. No, you jump off the sled to the side so that you don't um, get hurt. Well, I hope nobody attempts to go off the side of cliffs or go near cliffs. <laughs> don't. Yeah, no, it just, don't even think about it. <laughs> no, don't think about it. If that. you're in that situation, maybe you have no business being there. Yeah, but I would just be very careful and make sure if you're like, if you feel wet or like if you feel wet on your hands or something and then you start feeling numb, I would go inside and I would keep warm. Yeah, you don't want to get frostbite. If you start feeling numb toes, and numb fingers, numb ears, numb nose. You, <laughs> numb nose. It, it, it's a sign that you need to get inside. Right? Yeah, that's what I did. That's why I stopped because my heels were getting, my feet were getting but numb. You don't want to wait until it gets to that point because then it no. be too late. So you got to really, especially if you're younger kids, it, the younger you are, it's hard for your body to stay warmer. So. Hot chocolate's a good idea, but sugar-free. We have sugar-free hot chocolate. Yeah, I would go for the caffeine-free if possible myself, you know, I and sugar-free. Yeah. Because right, we got the natural stevia. Yes, and we make right, it to Yeah, I want. I'd be very careful up there. Oh, yeah, nobody wants to get frosted. And make sure, make sure you're not, like, gonna, I don't know, hit anybody else. Make sure you probably yeah. stay away from each other. Watch out for trees. Yeah, <laughs> watch out for trees. <laughs> I'm you like? on your iPhone with you because when we posted a, like a video last time, people say, "Holy boy, you're always bragging about your iPhone," but you never bragged about it. You no. never said, "Oh, look at me, I got an iPhone." To me, I feel like it's just an iPhone. It's nothing special. You want to brag about something? Brag about like a, you know, a Bugatti or something. <laughs> you know, a million dollar car maybe. But oh are you having God, fun out there? there? Yeah. Look at the window. Daddy, there's a blizzard. A lizard? No, no. Look. Not a lizard, a blizzard. It just won't stop. You remember the time we were at Daytona Beach? Yeah. Florida, Florida. And I accidentally killed a lizard inside of a box. I, I remember that. Yeah. And I made it, I accidentally sun baked right. it. Oh, <laughs> I God. feel sorry for that lizard. It was a pregnant lizard. Oh, no. I am so <sighs> So one advice, piece of advice is if you, if, you, if you feel like you're getting cold outside and your fingers are cold and stuff, don't be washing them in hot water. Yeah. Oh. Use room temperature. Start off, start off in room temperature. Don't be burning yourself. Ah. Ready? Ready? One, two, three. Oh. I know that it's tight. You're holding on tight, aren't you? Got it? Yeah, I got it. Okay. Yay, got your hair up. That's the way it's supposed to be, right? Right. Yeah. Hey! And I'm going to make where they go. Where did they go? Where'd I put them? Not these. Oh, what are you looking for? This. Ooh. Here, here, here. This is hot. He dropped it. It's hot. Take it. That's not hot. How's this messing with you? I don't know. I'm it's not, not a hot potato. I, <laughs> I almost messed up the oven. I locked it and then turned it off and then turned it back on and locked it. I don't know how to use an oven. Hey, Caitlin. <laughs> Pac Man. As always, I mean, we make family vlogs because of reality vlogs, and yeah. um, you really there, there's educational value in some of the stuff we do. You know, it's not just entertainment. There's life lessons, and um, sometimes they're very obvious, and sometimes you just gotta read into it more, or just keep watching, and you'll see, right?
My Things head don't is always. Mess. Yeah, well, it's morning time. I gotta wake up Caitlin a little bit. I gotta so. put this fruit smoothie stuff in my face. Before. Fruit smoothie. See, look, education. There you go. See, uh, we do science projects, right? We use a microscope for that stuff. We use all kinds of fun gadgets. And, uh, there's just a lot of things that we do. We don't record everything on video. You know, it's just, you know, some of our, you know, a lot of our lives we keep to ourselves. We don't just post every single thing we do. But that's just the way that goes. So educational value, yeah. Do we go on trips and make educational things about it? We do, but do I record it all? No. No, because we, we need some privacy because there's so many places we can go and things that we can do that uh, pretty much make a big footprint of where we are and we don't want to do that. We don't want to kind of lead people to where we live because we have privacy and we don't need to give out too much personal information, right? So you go on special trips anywhere and, you know, that's, it could lead to, uh, you know, just too much information or what you call TMI, right? So we got to get more of that stuff? Yeah, it's supposed to, like, cleanse, like, really, really cleanse your pores. That's good. As you know, we always, like, push healthy habits, healthy, healthy eating. You know, uh, I've always throw up a little message about safety here and, and just I always make a comment about something we always contribute some value to the video as far as you know something that's going to teach you a lesson and even pranks you're going to learn a lesson in pranks you've seen how I've justified you know, why you should do this why you shouldn't do that and uh, it becomes a lesson so what did you find here oh it's just my fruit smoothie stuff fruit smoothie yeah it's good Fruit smoothie. Hi. What you doing, huh? Papa. Papa TV. SpongeBob in the TV. Oh. Okay. Well, we won't watch him for so long because we're gonna okay. go and play okay. outside, right, Caitlin? Okay. Looking. 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 What happened to it? Never. Is that all better now? I saw what? Can't put it? <laughs> oh, sorry. That's yes, sir. I press it. You press it? You press it? I think I did. I press it. Wow. It won't be long and February's going to be over and it's going to be March, right? Yeah, I press it. It's going to be March soon. Give me. Give me. I got, now he's got to finish drying that, okay? You die? Yeah, Daddy's gonna finish drying it. <laughs> Let me finish drying it, then you can put it on, okay? Uh oh! Right there. Papa. What's he doing? Pillow. He's your pillow? Uh oh. And now it's like it's just about gone. And it's like 65 degrees out here. Look what happened. The snowman lost its head. It's a heavy, it's a tiny little head. She got back from school. School. It's like 65 degrees. Unbelievable. Can't believe it. First it's snowing and then boom. Right? Yep. I'm sad that it snows in it. Why is there sparkles on the ground? Right there. Huh. Oh, wait, that's because I sprayed um, hair stuff in the ground. That's right. So, uh. It's supposed to be fishtail. The educational value in our videos. There's life lessons, even in pranks, right? Because Brittany agrees. 
You learn lessons when you do pranks. Yes, kidding and fall. And you learn lessons yeah. when you're cooking. You learn lessons uh, just about. I love cooking. It's fun. So like Especially we, making tuna fish. It's not cooking, but we do a lot of fun things. We just don't record everything. I was trying to make that point across earlier <sighs> this morning. <laughs> Before you and Brittany went out to school. And... Uh, woo! Whoa! Yeah, this slushy. Oh, it is. You can make some ice cream with this, but I wouldn't yeah. do that. One year I made ice cream with snow. So this kid researched it, and he said the reason why they deleted Flappy Bird was because some teenager said she was gonna kill herself if they didn't delete the game from the App Store. And not, it's just a game. She said she got upset because she couldn't pass the level or something, but it's just a game. I'm Well, I, one time when I was playing that fish game on Club Penguin, I was yelling stupid fish, and I was getting really aggravated, but... Yeah, you, you wouldn't have to take it that far away Yeah, game, you, know? you don't have to harm yourself because of a game. This branch, it's like, it was this thick, maybe, maybe like that thick. It snapped and it was hanging down. I wonder if it's still hanging out there. No. But it know. snapped and it was, oh yes it is, it still is. Is it still out there? Yeah, it's still hanging on that tree, up there. Isn't it tree You up see there? it like moving back and forth? Oh. You see it? Oh, yeah. That, that's how, um, that's how thick yeah, it was. You that's might that. not want to be standing under that tree. <laughs> no, it's going right down on you. So it's Wednesday, what? I don't even know. Was it February Wednesday, 19th? February 19th, yes. 19th? Yeah. Because tomorrow's the 20th. I can remember that. Awesome. I love school. Huh. Okay, so now that we're on the topic of education and educational videos, um, well, what is it that you are actually making there, Brianna? Tuna fish. Wow, tuna fish. Well, that must be very healthy. It's got, it's got good protein in there, and it's not full of saturated fats. Yeah. And okay. you know, it's healthy to have fish with the omega-3 fatty acids, and of course, all that protein. What is that? How could you possibly go wrong? I have no idea. Well, I see the educational value in this video is pretty high, considering that I just talked about tuna fish. Wow. Wow. I've already put in the mayonnaise in the bowl because then when I open this... As an alternative to mayonnaise, you can actually use yogurt. Non-fat yogurt, which is much healthier than mayonnaise. You can use yogurt. And we have some in the refrigerator. And instead of buying soda that has artificial sweetener, you can get Zevia, which has natural sweeteners in it, which is healthy for you. This is starting to scare me. Because this is an educational video with some educational value. Okay, that's good. Now you must be very careful when pouring a tuna fish into the bowl, especially after you cut it open with the sharp, jagged edges that could be present after cutting the tin can open with the can opener. Okay. Always be careful with cans that are sharp, because you can cut your little fingers. But it looks like you know what you're doing. Mix it up that stuff in that mayonnaise, which I think would have been on the bottom of the list of nutritional things to be putting in your tuna fish. As I do recall, I was mentioning that this would have been a better alternative for a healthier tuna fish. But no, you went ahead and went with the mayonnaise. It's not even mayonnaise, it's classical whip, which is like a salad dressing in a whip form. But that's um, okay. Why would you put... But yolk? that's okay. What? Why would well, you... why would you not? Why? Look at all the protein. Wow, 22 couldn't, grams of protein. Couldn't you just... 40 milligrams of potassium. Couldn't you just have a small bowl of... Zero yogurt? fat. And while you're at it, why don't you add some flax, golden flax to your tuna fish and make it even healthier. Now, is this an educational video or what? 
I guess because you're saying putting mayo in kind of tuna. Yeah. I didn't know. Exactly. People are supposed to put... Absolutely. Okay, well, there you go. <laughs> oh, I don't want to scare you there, Brianna. But uh, if that, that was an educational video, maybe I just took it overboard, right? I don't think you're supposed yeah. to put mayo. I mean, oh, well, no yeah. You, actually, yeah, I was just being a little, uh, you know. Funny? Over the edge with it. <laughs> I was just taking a little too far. Wow. You want garlic with that? Oh, I got some garlic with that. You want some onion with that? I got some onion with that. Wow. I gotta put some Woo. black pepper with that. Oh boy. I think I'll be upstairs with everybody else. Have fun okay. with that. Okay, I'm gonna fun. have fun with my tuna. I'm gonna eat it. Yeah. I'm gonna go in my tummy. Oh boy. Brandon's making tuna fish. Thanks for watching. Please be sure to rate, comment, subscribe, and share this video with as much people as you can. Bye.